Bismillahir Rahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. So guys, in this video tutorial, I will show you how to use data validation to ensure data entry in Excel. So here we have already created empty table. So for that, we will set rules for ID name, age, date of birth and mobile numbers to keep the data clean and accurate. So let's get started. First, we will apply data validation on ID number. So for that, we will select this ID number because when we apply data validation, so we need to select that column. So I'll select this column, go to data tab and then click this validation. Click OK. So now we have a validation criteria. So we will apply from this any value. This is a drop down menu. So when we click on this, so we will show more option. So in this option, we will select custom. Now we will give a formula in this formula bar. So here equal number value bracket start select the range and bracket close and now click ok so now we apply data validation on this column so if i enter number so it will allow me to enter a number but if i enter any text so it will give me alert so you can see this value does not match the data validation restriction defined for the cell you can change this message so for that cancel this select this all go to data validation here we have a tab error alert click this and here give a title id error and give a message so here i will write please enter only numbers and click ok so when i enter text value and enter so it will show me this error so here we have a title id error and please enter only numbers so now we will apply data validation on this edge column so first we will fill this name column so here i'll type some names where mother said tanvir ahmed Mojib. now we will apply a edge restriction on this edge column so when we apply for any job so they want that person to who have between the age of 18 to 35 so we will apply that restriction so for that i select this edge column go to data tab click on this data validation go to this uh, setting tab now here we will select whole numbers so i'll select this here we will type two numbers for minimum and maximum so minimum age is 18 and maximum age is 35 click ok so when we enter 19 so it will allow me to enter when we enter 35 so it will also allow me to enter the number but when we enter 40 so it will give me age restriction so here you can see the value does not match the data validation restriction defined for the cell so now we will change this message so for that we will select this column go to data validation tab go to error tab and here we will give a title age error and in the error message i will type you are not eligible and click ok so now if i enter 16 so it will give me error so you can see the title is age error and here the message is you are not eligible now let's move to data birth so we will apply data validation on data birth so i'll select this column go to data validation and here in any value i'll select that now we will give two dates so in data birth we will write 01011985 this is our starting date and in date 01012000 okay so when i enter a value between 1985 and 2000 so it will allow me to enter so i'll give a date 
1997 at enter you can see it will allow me to enter date of birth so if i enter 2001 so it will give me error at enter you can see the value does not match the data validation restriction between for the cell you can change this message as well now we will apply on phone number so i'll select this go to data validation click any value and select text length so here we will give two value we want 10 for phone number so 10 values minimum 10 and maximum also 10 so okay if i enter 10 value zero three zero one four three four three five six three so it will allow me to enter if i enter 11 value so it will give me error so you can see it will give me a restriction error so that's it for today we are learned how to apply data validation in excel table this ensures your data stay clean and error free if you found this video helpful please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you for watching and see you in the next video